Welcome back everybody 1013 and the Dr. Pepper Museum in Waco is a tourist hotspot with more than 250,000 artifacts on site, a quarter of a million. And there's a lot to learn, but it's not all sweet. Oh no, there's a little taste of tension. Six News anchor Bailey Bates joins us now in studio to give us the bone chilling haunted scoop. <laughs> I feel it. Yeah, Rob, employees tell me there's uh, more bubbling beneath the museum floors and meets the eye. And tonight we share a few of the mysterious tales that just might send a chill down your spine. The stories you can find at the Dr. Pepper Museum go back over a century. There's a lot of rich history. Um, with the soda industry in general, and we're able to tell many of those stories. As a collections manager for the museum, it's Rachel Nadu Johnson's goal to tell them all, even if they aren't all as sweet as the popular soda. There is definitely a lot of spookiness, uh, specifically with our museum buildings. Yes, it is some sort of haunted. <laughs> Working at the downtown Waco property for over 10 years, she's had her fair share of bizarre encounters. I shut the office door behind me. It locks when you shut it. And I came back to the office door being cracked open. And then I heard people whispering. And I said, I don't know who's supposed to be up here right now other than me. And then the door slammed shut in front of my face. And then I opened the office and no one was in here. The haunting isn't isolated. An unpleasant presence can be felt in the soda fountain too, especially for those serving up the sweets. Some of them have reported experiencing their apron strings being tugged on or their hair being pulled, sort of like in a playful manner. The employees have a hunch as to what or who is behind the mysterious happenings. There are also some theories that we might just have some residual energy or poltergeist activity uh, that was created by the 1953 tornado that went through the center of downtown. But nobody really knows. The only way to find out is if you dare to step in. Well, the Dr. Pepper Museum has paranormal tours every Saturday year round too. It doesn't even happen around Halloween only. You can see for yourself the stories behind every strange creek and shadow and maybe get the feeling that you're not alone. If you want to watch the full story, we have it on our streaming app 6 plus and will run right after this newscast. Rob. All right, not sure if there's ghosts or not, but we are sure there is no period, no period. after doctor. <laughs> we learned you taught us that Bailey. Thank you much.